automating Asana with WhatsApp Business just became possible with SuperChat. We are using the WhatsApp API uh, with SuperChat, so you can easily build automations that, for example, can be used as a digital agency where you inform your clients about a done project with one click just via WhatsApp business. Maurizio, what are possible use cases and benefits of automating Asana um, and WhatsApp business via SuperChat? Yeah, I think currently we have some, as you mentioned, some agencies which are using it for shorter feedback cycles. Mm -hmm. So it's very, very easy to just say like, okay, a task or a project is done in Asana and I just want to inform my client or get some feedback on it. The easy way you do it, you just take the project, move it to done and automatically a WhatsApp message is sent to the client and then you get some feedback, you can iterate the project or you just say, okay, we're done. Let's okay. keep moving on. Nice. Sounds really good. Um, this can be done via Zapier, Make or even our own API. What is really important, you just need a SuperChat account where the WhatsApp business API is already connected. This literally takes a couple of minutes with SuperChat and then you are able to actually build this automation. And how this is done is actually going to be shown by Maurizio in a second. You will have a full tutorial um, and I would say happy building. All right, let's first dive into Asana because here we need a few things before we can actually start building the SAP. So first of all, we need a tag which is actually added to the task. So I created a new tag here, send super chat message. Second, we need the phone number, like best case, the phone number of the client we want to send a WhatsApp message to. And then I added like two additional fields, like first name and last name of the client to have a little bit more personalization as soon as we send the message. Then second point, we go to Super Chat and we actually need the WhatsApp template we're gonna send to the client. So I already created a quick template here and approved it. Um, it's just like, hey, first name, could you provide some feedback on the project? here and then the wildcard the wildcard will be a link to the task and then the client can just have a click on it and just give us some feedback either in asana or directly via whatsapp then next point we got everything set up to actually start building the sap let's dive into sapio trigger we need a trigger in this case it's pretty simple we're choosing asana and then tag added to task and then continue we connect our account check and then we choose the workspace usually pretty simple because you're gonna be just in one workspace and now we're gonna look for all the tags i just have this one tag if you have several tags you probably have to search for it but i'll take this and super chat message tag now and then we're testing the trigger perfect here we got a task with a tag, that's it. And we continue with that record. Second step now, we want to connect SuperChat with it to send the WhatsApp template. Send WhatsApp template, check, continue, connect our account, perfect. And now, to which phone number we want to send it to? In Asana, this should be some custom field, probably somewhere down there. If you don't find it easily, and use like I did, if you just added like a phone number you know, you can just also search for the phone number. Um, ah, perfect, it's this custom field, so it's a bit quicker. Then from, like which WhatsApp number you want to choose, and then you choose your template. Perfect, in our case it's called Asana Feedback in English. There it is. So, first name, we already set it up. It was Mika. So we somehow find the value, text value, perfect. And the wildcard, now we want to send the link of the Asana task. So perfect, we just go here quickly. We copy the task link because I just want to see how they build up. Uh, we have asana.com and then we have here the ID of the link of the task the project so what we're gonna do now we go back to sapier let's first search for it okay we have the id uh, perfect it's this one and now we have to set up the link in a similar way we just go here 
that's it. We just need the first part of it. And then we add it in Sapien. In front of the wildcard. Perfect, perfect. Continue test step. All right, uh, what the message was sent. We go back to Super Chat. We go into our inbox. And we already have the link. Hey Mika, could you provide some feedback on the project here? Including the link. Let's click on the link and see if we end up on the task. Perfect, task is open, we're here. And that's it. Imagine I would be a different user. Um, I could just write some feedback here. Of course, what always works too. I just grab my phone. I got a little message, some feedback. I like it. And that's it. So your client basically has two ways to give you feedback, either directly in Asana or via WhatsApp. And that's it. Thank you really much, Maurizio, for actually showing how this automation is built. Any last words from your side? Yeah, I think this is just one small use case how you can use Asana and WhatsApp. Mm -hmm. And I think what's another big use case we sometimes have is if a new WhatsApp message is incoming, you want to create a task or a project out of this message. For example, you say like, okay, there's a new client. He writes me a message. I want to create a task out of it mm -hmm. in Asana. This is possible too. If you want to see this video or any other use case with Asana, just leave us a comment. Tell us what use cases are inter interesting for you. And then we were just going to build it. And nice. Sounds really good. Happy building. <laughs>